And then the final minute uh, before this shepherding spacecraft impact will be called Flight crater mode. Science, please change NIR1 to OPR9. Over. Copy NIR1 to OPR9. The command flight set it up. Set November or Mike. November. Science flight confirmed November. that's November. November. IR. We are, uh, the science team is now communicating to the flight team to uh, adjust some camera science levels. Flight confirmed near infrared, November, correct? On Confirm. Near infrared uh, camera. Off send, NIR1 to OPR9. Copy, sending command. All stations flight, mark Centaur impact. That was an announcement by the flight director that the uh, center impact should have. Uh, flight director confirm receipt of uh, command, over. Flight payload, curtain start, over. Copy that payload. We should be looking for uh, some signs of the impact on the leftmost part and of the. Standing by uh, with mid infrared changes. The left side of the shadow, right below the uh, the dimpled crater on the crater, the larger crater rim. Flight, this is science. Make the rate changes. MIR one, one hertz. MIR two, zero point one hertz. Over. Mark, transition to DV mode. Flight, NIR2, OPR change request. NIR2 to OPR 10. Over. Is that Copy. November? NIR2 to OPR yes. Confirm. 10. Confirm. November. Ready? Command flight send November IR2 to OPR 10. Command send. Flight payload confirm receipt of command. Copy payload. These are standby for shepherding spacecraft impact. The very last second of the uh, shepherding spacecraft trajectory as it approaches the lunar surface. We are seeing very small craters within the we, crater. We confirm a thermal signature of the crater. Our mid our cameras. Over. Copy science. We just All received light shepherding spacecraft impact. Stations report LOS. The uh, ground stations at Goldstone just reported last a last track is 11.35.35.054 seconds. The shepherding spacecraft has hit the surface of the moon, and this marks the end of the L-Cross uh, flight mission.